Hi, I'm Kira Walsh. And I'm Leah Williamson. And, and this, this is Questions. questions. <laughs> <laughs> What's your pre-match meal? Ham sandwich. <laughs> That's so dead. <laughs> okay, you order a takeout. Yeah. Um, and it's, is it your own meal or do you share? Oh. I know the answer to this. I don't think I'm sharing. Not <laughs> a single chance you're sharing. No, I was trying to make myself out to be a nice person. That's why we're good friends, because I don't like the same food that you like, so I'll never take it. Yeah, because you only like plain food, that's why. All right. <clears throat> what was your initiation song? Stand By Me, Benny King. You fancy yourself as a bit of a singer, don't you? Kira do you wants... want to do a little rendition for us now? <laughs> I think, I'm all right, I think actually. that's only. Mm. No? No. Actually, no, I'm okay. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Just checking. Kira caught me singing Hosea Take Me to Church once in my bedroom, full throttle. And you was never going let, for it. <laughs> let me live it down no, since. I haven't. Ah, have you got any pre match superstitions? I always put my shin pads on the opposite legs. I don't know why. It's quite weird, isn't it? But someone pointed it out to me the other day and I didn't realise that I do it. But What, you wear them on the wrong leg? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Don't know why. Just do. I mean, you can't change that now. No, I'm going to have to stick with it. Maybe that's why you're so good, I might start doing that. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> I get a bit nervous when you get them out of the box. Favourite goal? There's not many to choose from. Um, I think scoring against Czech Republic, and then you gave me a hug straight after. I was just about to say to leave it. I was going to leave it, leave it, leave it. <laughs> Oh, it's gone in. <laughs> you actually oh, said oh, that. It's going in. Oh my god, it's going <laughs> in. <laughs> best goal or save you've ever made, so best goal. I don't know, I'll go for my goal against Birmingham last year. It was a good one. Little cutback from Jill Scott. Bit of, bit of finesse on it. Just You're all it about finesse. You can't do anything about finesse. Yeah, so yeah, I'll go with that one. Not a bad goal. <laughs> <laughs> What's your Nando spice? Oh god. Just out of me these questions. <laughs> Nothing. I think it's called plainish when you uh It does have a little bit of spice on though before it goes on the grill, so Yeah. It's I not think that's completely like plain. Plainish. I mean, it disappoints everybody, but I like what I like. You do. Where were you when you got the England call up? Let's go with your first England call up. Um I don't I think I must have been at training maybe, I think. Nick probably told me when he shouldn't have done the manager at the time because I think he was oh, just so... Oh, you hadn't got the email Yeah, yet. Like, so buzzing for me. But um, it was kind of nice because obviously Mo was manager at the time and yeah. we had her at under-19s and she was such a good person and a good coach, so... I, I was actually at Nando's when I got the... Was she? Yeah. yeah, and then I called you before I called my mum. Having a plain-ish. Having a plain-ish <laughs> plain Nando's. Plain Nando's and I rang you and then called my mum. I think she... I might have texted you before my mum, but that's yeah. surprising. <laughs> sorry, sorry mum, if you're watching this video. <laughs> she won't be surprised no, by that she either. Won't eat, she won't at all. Tracy texts me to see how you are on camp because <laughs> you don't respond to her. <laughs> I'm laughing because this would be so funny. Would you rather have fingers as long as your legs or legs as long as your fingers? <laughs> <laughs> well, your legs are very long, so... <laughs> I'd have to go with legs as long as my fingers. What would you do with fingers as long as yeah, my what legs? What would you do with legs as long as... I mean, either or. It's not really... A, there's not really a good option, is there? <laughs> Who would you play in a movie and why? Everyone calls me the girl of Orange is the New Black with the ginger frizzy hair, but I don't know her name. You know what I mean, She's in you? American Pie as well. Yeah. Mm. She's funnier. Yeah. Well, she, yeah, uh, okay, she'd yeah. have to play him. The, the, the hair and she's funny. Yeah. So that'd okay. be a suitable. We'll go with that. Yeah. What's your pre match meal? Ham sandwich. <laughs> That's so dead. <laughs> <laughs> There's a ham sandwich you can get from Tesco's, no mayo, 99p. Is that the one that you have? I can't, I can't eat, get nervous. When I'm here, I eat because there's nothing else to do, but when you're at home. What else are you doing at home before a game? Off gallivanting. <laughs> Go <laughs> <laughs> oh, good question. Three guests to come for dinner, who's invited? Leah Williamson would make the cut, obviously. Obviously. I feel like I love David Silver, like all time favourite footballer. Yeah. Obsessed with him. Obsessed so with him. He would be there. Brilliant. We'd um, have lots of conversation flowing since we all speak the same language. Yeah, and Whoopi Goldberg, because we both love Sister Act and yeah, Can't she's just get incredible, any better than that. so <laughs> 
<laughs> I feel like you give off this persona that you're like super cool and like on the slide people just really don't know do you're they? the only one well fit other people know now just favorite sport other than football I mean I like my netball I really like my netball so probably. your mum loves it as well my mum loves it I love going to watch my mum play netball shout out to my mum she's yeah, a great shout out to Amanda. you can only talk to one person for the rest of your life who would it be does it have to be a person would you talk to your dog? Yeah, like I think I'd be happy with just talking to my dog for the rest of <laughs> my life and just sitting there and just chilling. I'm not sure what that says about you as a person, but... What, that I just love animals? Okay, so, I'll take it. Yeah. I'll take it. If you could be the lead in a TV show, which show would it be? Like, I've just got on, like, I just imagine you it'd be like the most incredible TV show about the most <laughs> incredible person <laughs> <laughs> and you would have to play them. <laughs> Oh goodness! <laughs> I don't know. You've you've blocked me. It's you'd have that. to you'd have to be on like the Crown or something. The Crown. <laughs> I'm not that I mean, funny, Elizabeth. so I'd actually go with something funny because I'd want to be funny. But if we were actually going for me, it'd be something like Big Bang Theory, geeky or okay, something. Okay, fair. Wouldn't it? There's nothing I mean, wrong with being smart, by the way. Smart, and then there's you balance it out in this friendship. Oh, do I? <laughs> Oh, this is a good question for you, I know what you'd answer. Never clean your teeth again or never wash your hair again? Never wash my hair again. Absolutely. You can't go around with breath all day, forever. Hot, hot breath. Oh no, that'd be the worst. Just you'd be the sort out. of friend though who would just let me walk around all day with no, bad I breath or would. food in my teeth and you just wouldn't say anything to me. I don't think I would, no. <laughs> Sorry. What is the strangest thing you have ever eaten? Worst person to ask that to. Have you not like ever tried anything on a holiday, extravagant or? No. No. I'd probably pee. A pee? Yeah. What weighs more, a ton of bricks or a ton of feathers? Weigh the same, both a ton. Ah. Nailed it. <laughs> no flies on you. Would you rather wear clothes two sizes too small or two sizes too big? <laughs> not the baggy look. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we went out for dinner recently and I literally must have had the baggiest clothes on. You told me I looked okay and you let me go out and you obviously thought I didn't. <laughs> no, I knew that was the style we were going for. I didn't want to put you down. But I don't know the answer to this, so I'm intrigued. If you weren't a footballer, what would you be? I don't know. I'd probably, probably be like a, a geography I'll... teacher or something. Oh, yeah. I was going to say something to do with animals, but you... I do like animals. You used to love geography at school. I feel like I would open like a dog kennel or like a doggy daycare. Or... Oh, yeah, that'd be but nice. But I do like geography, so maybe something to do with that as well. Oh, I know that. Um, I don't know. I think I know the answer to this. Would you rather go on Strictly or X Factor? <laughs> <laughs> X Factor must be. If I could sing. <laughs> oh, bless me. <laughs>